Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, today's date, it is October 26th of 2018, Friday night. It's uh, 10.35 p.m. I'm in Fort Worth, Texas. I uh, want to give you a little bit of an update. Uh, as you know, I had some problems with my brand new uh, blue Vivo 11 Plus. I had a Bluetooth error of some type that I reported on. So I returned it and uh, they picked it up today. Uh, Amazon is, I'm sure you know, probably, you're probably an Amazon user. They're really good about, and it's been that way since they started. I've been using them for uh, a long time. Um, but I almost never return anything or have a problem. I did return a camera one time that broke uh, within the first month. Total, a total failure on the thing. Uh, and as soon as I, you know, reported it and they had UPS come and bring me a sticker to put on the box to uh, ship out and everything, Immediately they refunded before they got it uh, They refunded my money and I was hoping they would do the same this time, but anyway, I uh, The UPS came out today to pick up and they bring a shipping thing for the outside of Whatever you put it in whatever box you put it in and then of course inside you put a print out of a barcode in your name or something and that's just in case the box should break open or something so uh, I took a little nap here just a while ago woke up and there was a message from uh, Amazon that uh, they had credited my account with the money for the phone and then I immediately logged in and I immediately uh, ordered this telephone in fact in gold the uh, Sony Xperia XA2 Ultra and it's a six inch phone but apparently it's pretty massive which is fine with me I've if you watch my videos you'll uh, see I, I like bigger you know heavier products and uh, this is definitely bigger and well I think the uh, I think it was 6.2 I believe the uh, blue was but this is a six inch screen and has but it has the uh, as you can see it's uh, side to side screen but it has a, a top bezel and a block bottom bezel of pretty good size and it weighs uh, the people who were reviewing it a couple of them mentioned it was like half a pound that it weighs <laughs> Or whatever so it's a big uh, man I have small hands but I don't have a problem with I don't use a cell phone that much except well I do use it for like authentication uh, two-tier authentication for stuff and I put in my and I could put it in on my I do put in my diabetes uh, my blood readings and things that on on Usually I'll do it on the cell phone and not here, but I don't use the phone a lot. Uh, but I'm very happy with the service from Amazon always. Well, except I had hundreds and hundreds of reviews on Amazon and they deleted all of my reviews. No notice to me of why they did it. Of course, I know why they did it. They thought that I was... Uh, not doing them fairly because I gave such good reviews for the products that I reviewed or something like that. But I don't know. I was never warned. I was never told that they were going to delete them. And I, the only way I found out that they were uh, deleting them was uh, somebody who's following me said, your reviews are all gone, you know. But anyway, very happy with Amazon service. They refunded my money right away. I immediately logged in and it's going to my new cell phone will be here Monday and uh, uh, 
I mean, I could live without. Well, actually, after I collapsed, um, a few years ago, down at Walgreens at like 8 at 30 at night or whatever, um, I actually, carry, if I go to the mailbox, I carry my cell phone. If I go to, I have a pacemaker in me, but so there's no problem. But I do, uh, I feel totally, uh, I want to have, I'm not sure who I'd call other than 911 for something. Uh, but uh, I do t for that, for uh, not afraid of, you know, an assault or an attack or whatever, but just if, if I go out and collapse or something or there. So I do want to have a cell phone. Uh, maybe the biggest use, I don't go any place very often, but when I do, I usually go by Uber. I don't have a car. So I go by Uber, so I use it for Uber. So, but I'll be happy, very happy because right now I don't have a cell phone. And I'll be very happy to uh, to get this on Monday. Now, as you know, I'm using a new microphone. In fact, you can see it right there. And I, I'm not saying, I don't think I actually did a review of it. I showed it to you, talked to you a little bit about it. But wait a minute, somebody, very wise person, said that when I do something like this, I should uh, go full screen so you can actually, because, I, because I, I really forget that a lot of you people, an awful lot of people, I forget what percentage of my uh, viewers, but you're using uh, a cell phone or something, you know? So better to have full screen. Uh, now this microphone uh, is a dynamic microphone and it will work with USB or XLR and I'm sure you can see here's the XRL cable going into it. So I and I recorded uh, I think the video right before this uh, to do with the other microphone. I just moved it. Hang on a second. Don't touch that dial. Uh, the video I think that uh, I made, I think this morning, uh, I was using this microphone and uh, so you would have a sample of it, and then this microphone, and then I ask you which is best. Uh, and uh, I think this one is really the best, maybe. But either one sounds good. But anyway, this is a uh, XLR or USB microphone. And uh, just wanted to mention I, that... Uh, when I was doing the testing, Heather, it runs into a sound box, as this one was also running into the same sound box. Um, and I did the review, and it was hard to tell which, well, at least I wasn't doing this with the, um, it was hard to see a difference. I think, but uh, so they're both about equal. But then after I finished the video, and did have effect, it was just a while ago, not long ago. I thought, wait a minute, I never tested the USB using this just as you know, disconnecting the uh, XLR, yeah, cable. And I also, to make it fair, I disconnected the uh, box, and then I hooked up the a USB. Uh, cable and I just couldn't get the volume up the volume was just too and I've had that trouble in the past with USB microphones or what have you so uh,
the other thing I wanted to mention to you because I'm not uh, I think this is a good a good microphone and for the price uh, excellent I'll put a link to it again uh, USB XLR dynamic microphone with accessories comes with a USB cable and also comes with the XLR cable and uh, the tripod you know information here are the uh, thing so you can use this on a stand um, on the instructions I don't usually read the instructions you don't really need the instructions but it uh, see where it says Q to you and then there's a green LED and then it says USB okay that they indicate that uh, that's the on and off there's an on and off switch there and that when it's on and is powered and is working that you get the LED lights up uh, it lights up on USB but it doesn't light up for and the microphone appears to be working it doesn't light up for the uh, XLR so if you do purchase the microphone and the LED doesn't light up for XLR uh, I think that's it's it's working you know it's working because we don't have the LED now and it's it's working so uh, I've had these a long time I took these to work for for a while when I was working uh, at, a, at a hospital security or whatever and I was uh, I had those not now if I had something going on I, I, I wasn't standing there in front of a, a drunk or whatever doing this or whatever but so I think that's it um, Monday when I get the new cell phone I hope everything goes okay with I have uh, T-Mobile service so it should I have the SIM card and the I only have a 56 okay I really I've spent too much money anyway you know but I uh, I should get a 256 meg or 256 gig um, to put in there but hope the switch over goes okay and then I'll I'll take some I'll make some pictures I'll take some pictures and do a little bit of video with it but there again I'm not going to try to uh, do a review of it I'm not going to do an unboxing I'm not going to tr try to do a review of it but I will tell you you know I will show you a little bit and I'll show you some pictures uh, let you know how how it works um, I liked the blue phone the blue cell phone I think I'm actually gonna like this Sony better I think I've had uh, I need to wipe my nose for some reason I've been eating nachos or um, chips and dip uh, picante dip maybe allergic to some spices uh, so what else is going let's see whoops oh okay yeah I, I should uh, Here's, I got the gold color uh, phone. So, um, looking forward to getting it, but Let's 
see. Okay, I'm going to watch, I think I watched some of these already, I wish I could filter them out. Uh, I'm going to watch some uh, YouTube videos of this cell phone. I think I've already, I've already watched a bunch and I already know all the main points and the negative points and uh, whatever, but I still I'll uh, want to watch some of these videos and then I guess I'll try to sleep as much as I'm not working. I'm 77 years of age, not working, so I'll just try to sleep as much as I can, which is, if you're old as I am, it's probably not a good idea to sleep away your, your time, but I'm just going to try to sleep as much as I can until my new cell phone comes and hope that it does not have some type of a Bluetooth error because other phones had that same problem I found out when I was searching for a uh, for an answer this is probably annoying isn't it <laughs> I won't do this anymore I had to look for something and uh, then ran across these I forgot that I had them anyway I do thank you we're getting a few more subscribers uh, the amount of commission that I make from YouTube is inching up a little bit, a little bit at a time. It's below, I think it's about $39 for the last 28 days. And it's been running for a long time, like $25 per 30 days. Now it's up. I'm hoping it continues a little bit. I spend more than that, of course, on software and hardware, and so I'm not making any money. But I would like to see it get up to, well, $50 a month. That way I would, because they only pay you when uh, you have a commission earned of $100. So, like, I've been getting uh, $100 from YouTube or Google uh, every three months. And if it inches up here, it'd be nice to get that $100 coming in every two months. But it'd really be nice to uh, get it where every month I got $100. Uh, because I spend out X amount of money for YouTube Red, which I think they call it YouTube Premium now or something. And I, I just paid, uh, <clears throat> upgraded uh, some software that does a screen, that's what I'm using to do the screen capture right now. And does uh, photo edit or video editing. I just again paid to, you know, to upgrade it. And I pay for some other things. And then I buy, you know, stuff stuff that I don't need to have but that I I want to try or that I think will make it easier for me or something so be nice if it would be nice if we get up to a hundred dollars a month that would be nice every month you know if I would uh, get money from YouTube slash Google uh, was is that annoying enough well, then how about this? I also found this when I was looking for... Actually, I was looking for the... That, that was what it was. <laughs> what are you looking for? There's somebody in my room. Sounds like a female. What are you looking for? The secret to life. Do you want to shop for secret to life? I want to know why I exist. The top search result for Secret to Life is Ikigai, the Japanese secret to a long and happy life. It's $13.59 on Amazon. Remember, you can check your Alexa app for product details and seller information. Would you like to buy it? Oh, no, honey. Thank you anyway. Hmm. I don't understand. 
Would you like to buy it? No, no, thank you. All right. I can now send more search results to Jim's phone as an Amazon app notification. Would you like to try it? Please, no. I didn't catch that. Would you like that sent to Jim's phone? No. Okay. Let's see what else I can find. I also found a secret Echo. life. The Pope... Exit. Sorry. I can't do that yet. Would you like to buy it? No. Exit. Hmm. I don't understand. Sorry. I can't tell if you want to make this purchase or not. Please try again. No. Echo. I heard her feelings. Echo. Oh, wow. Maybe I should have bought something. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. Oh, my God. I'm going to go and hide someplace. I think there's an entity in here someplace. There's something here. Wish me 